Hey guys, this is me on a beach in Bali. I haven't done any filming in Bali. Um, sorry about that. Um, there really has not been a lot of time to do it. Um, with deadlines creeping in for applications to schools, um, needing to get in uh, different like assignments, things like that. I really have to add to like put it on hold. And like for a personal, uh, just for myself as well, it's nice to end uh, our Southeast Asia trips um, on a more relaxed note. So it's been really nice to just let the impressions kind of wash over me without trying to capture it on film. But I will do my usual impressions from video because these are some of my favorite videos to make. I, I think they're really fun to just kind of sum up. Uh, yeah. Impression number one, living by the beach has been fantastic. It's really nice to just walk down to the beach and take a swim in the morning. Uh, you know, sure it's a very touristy area, but the beach just makes up for that in such a big way. I mean, check out this. So yeah, this is really nice. Impression number two. Finding vegan food here has been crazy easy. I, in our street, there's like there's a there's a vegetarian uh, full of vegetarian store and restaurant cafe. A little further down the street, there's a fully vegan and mostly raw restaurant. And you know, like anywhere you go, there's just like a vegan restaurant, vegetarian cafe. You know, like everywhere. Uh, maybe because it's so close to Australia, I don't know. Which brings me to impression number three. Most of the people there are Australians. I mean, I'm pretty sure there are more Australians here than Balinese people. It, yeah. It's probably because it's so close. It's like a three, four, five hour flight to Australia. Yeah, so it's not that strange. Impression number four. The pestering here is insane and incessant. Like, you can't walk five minutes down the street without being honked at by, like, every passing taxi being shouted at by uh, store owners on both sides of the streets, having massage professionals uh, interrupting your conversation to try to sell you something, being approached by someone with sunglasses, um, being handed some flyers by some guy on a tack on a like a scooter. It's like it's it's like never ending, and it's so annoying. It's like to the point where it has just put a major damper on you know, like my impression of Bali. That being said, this is a really touristy part of Bali. You know, that's what you get when you go to a touristy part. Like, but as I mentioned, you know, the beach kind of does make up for it. Yeah, it does. It makes up for it. It's worth it. So yeah, there is a slight annoyance of tourist culture, but you know, you just gotta kind of shrug it off and then enjoy the beach. Impression number five, I'm officially hooked on smoothie bowls. Ever since we discovered Nolly Bowls, which is this smoothie bowl cafe, we, uh, we've been coming back every day. And like when every time I finish my breakfast, I'm like, uh, tomorrow I can have more. It is so good. And it's, yeah, it is my absolute definitive obsession right now. For good coffee, uh, we're in the Semenyak area. It's kind of a little bit outside of the more touristy Kuta. I can't imagine how that is. Um, but yeah, for coffee in this area, I'd recommend uh, Astronomy. They have great espresso. It's an Indian, um, Ethiopian, and Colombian espresso brewed on a brand new Lama Soko. It's excellent. Um, and Brickhouse, which follows suit as a close second place with uh, uh, Guatemala and brewed on Rancilio. So yeah, coffee is definitely, really good coffee is definitely findable on Bali. Oh, and both these places offer soy milk, so thumbs up. Impression number six, um, did I mention the beach? It looks like this. The beach. Impression number eight, we had more durian. 
We bought one entire big spiky smelly lovely durian and opened it and had it had it at the beach. And needless to say, we like it. Uh, it's really nice and it's filling, so yeah. Gonna miss the durian, gonna miss the beach. I think that's it for this time. Uh, this is actually gonna be my last video from Asia. It's been really, really fun to, you know, kind of make these vlogs. Um, I hope you've enjoyed watching them. I'm gonna keep making some videos when I come back to Norway, I'm pretty sure. Uh, but for now, let's just let the ocean wave goodbye.